I have served um, over 40 years in the funeral industry since 1972. I think having all the services under one roof is a convenience factor for most families. Um, you come to one place and make all the difficult decisions and we try to make it more bearable, um, if at all possible, because they are difficult decisions to make, but just not having to leave to go to the florist and leave to go to the cemetery or um, check out the crematory or whatever, it's all right here. Yes, there's definitely a benefit to have a husband and wife team as a funeral director. Um, there's a lot of things that a lady can do that a man can't do. And um, so when those situations come up that I would call on my wife, Tony to come in and meet with the family because there's an issue that they can resolve better than I. And there's other benefits too. I think, I think just being a family, when you greet other grieving families that are coming in on a difficult day, I think it just makes it easier to sit down. It's like you're talking with friends, which is one family to another. Prearranging really is an act of love. Uh, you know, we, like, we plan for a lot of things in our life. We need to plan for death. Uh, I've done this for many years, and I've prearranged a lot of funeral services. And over those years, I've never had anybody uh, come in and say they were sorry they prearranged the funeral services because they come in and say, gosh, I'm so glad my mom or dad had taken the time to take care of this advance because I didn't know what they wanted. And they're glad that was not on their plate when death occurred. In prearranging funeral services, there's two ways you can do that. You can prearrange You can do a prearrangements with prepayments or without prepayments. The advantage of prepaying a funeral service is it freezes the price of the funeral. And number two, if you prepay it, you can do it over installments so that you can do it over monthly installments up to 10 years. And God forbid, if we were to die before it was paid off, it can be paid for you in full by the insurance. Every person is unique and so the service should be tailored to that person and to that family's uh, needs and beliefs. We've done everything from balloon releases to um, carriage, um, horse and carriage, escorting them to the funeral site. It can be as unique as the personality and should be. That's the way, that's the way stories become memories and memories help people in their grieving process. So it should be unique. What would normally happen when we're planning a funeral is that we would uh, meet with a family here at the funeral home and we'd go over all the questions that we need to, to decide what type of funeral they want. It could be church, chapel, graveside, a lot of options there. Once that's determined, then the next part we talk about the, the uh, items of merchandise they might need for that particular type of service. We'd go over that with them. And then after that, we would you know, pick the space out and help them with the flower arrangement, things of that nature. So, the whole arrangement would last probably about an hour, maybe an hour and a half, depends upon how many questions they have. And then after that, we would put together um, a personalized service based on the information they had given us when they came in.